I'm Dot Spade of getoutofbackpain.com. Today, I'm gonna to show you a move to help stretch out the low back. I have a firm belief that most people can feel better. So let's see what we can do to help your back feel better. I'm sitting in a chair. The chair does not have wheels. You don't wanna do this on a chair with wheels. And I'm gonna scooch to the front of the chair. We're gonna separate the knees a comfortable distance apart. If you feel like this is an inner groin stretch, then your knees are too far apart. So bring them back where they're a comfortable distance apart and it does not feel like an inner groin stretch. And then we're gonna pretend there's a comfortable band wrapped around our torso, lifting the torso up. So our torso is coming up away from our tailbone, hands stay on the legs, and I'm coming forward with a flat back. You see my back stays flat? I'm not rounding it forward. See the difference? Flat back. And then we're gonna hinge up from the hips with a flat back. Notice my back didn't move as I came up. Let's do that again. So I'm gonna lift my torso up as far away from the tailbone as possible, top of the head to the ceiling of the string. And I'm gonna keep my hands on my legs, walk my hands forward, let my back stay flat as I come forward, as far forward as I can. I'm not trying to go over, I'm trying to come forward, okay? As far forward as I can with my back flat. See how it feels. Just hang out. Count to 10. Count to 10. And then on the way up, we're gonna pretend we have a hinge at the hips and come up, keep the hands on the legs, flat back. That's a flat back version of a seated forward bend. There's many other moves that are great for back pain. That's just one. You can find a lot more information on my website, getoutofbackpain.com, and also on YouTube. If you have back pain that you haven't been able to figure out how to get rid of, contact me on my website. Let's see what we can do. That's fate, getoutofbackpain.com. Thanks for watching.